Did you know more than 50 million Americans knit or crochet? Even superstars Ryan Gosling, mm -hmm. Julia Roberts, David Arquette, and Catherine Zeta-Jones are avid knitters. And it's no wonder that knitting is one of America's favorite pastime because knitting is actually a de-stressor and can actually lower your heart rate by about 10 beats per minute, really. And in her book, Becoming a Knitting Superstar, Liat Gott tells us how knitting can save our lives. Well, I like anything that saves my life. Liat, thank you so much for being here. <laughs> Julia Roberts and Ryan Gosling are avid knitters, but you don't have to be a superstar to be a superstar knitter. <laughs> I like that, good. Good to know, because so. I'm ready to learn. Okay, let's start with this. What are five ways that knitting can really save our lives? Because it's almost too good to be true in my head. Check this out. Number one, I've had over 500 students tell me how knitting saved their sanity okay. when they were hospitalized after a debilitating injury like oh, wow. being paralyzed or losing the ability to walk. Right. Knitting actually helped them get through that. Many people took up knitting after they got injured. That's what helped them get through. That's so the amazing. next time you find yourself in the hospital, send for a pair of knitting needles stat. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's Press the first the way, button, right? That's the first way. Number two, knitting can help people recover from traumatic brain injury, recover their motor function. I had a student tell me about how she had a golf ball sized brain bleed oh. that caused her two seizures and a stroke. Wow. Taking up knitting actually helped her regain the use of her hands when nothing else could. That's incredible. Incredible, right? Yes. Number three, knitting is a relaxing sanctuary that can bring you back into balance when life gets too crazy. Which we all when, can say that, yeah, right? Yeah, when it's so hectic that you can't even think straight, knitting mm -hmm. is there to, like you said, lower your heart rate, get you back down into balance again. That's incredible. Number four, knitting is can help you stay cool in situations that would just make people absolutely <laughs> crazy. Now picture this. Okay. Like you're in your car driving with your boyfriend and he took a wrong turn. You're supposed to just go downtown and instead you're out the boonies and like you got Google Maps right there yeah. but he won't look at it right you're already, you're already ready already. I'm already like <laughs> so come on freaking come on. out and getting yeah. all bitchy you just smile and you take up your knitting and you're like baby just let me know when we're there I know you know where we're going that's good <laughs> and that's right a there, good you saved your relationship and you saved your sanity I like and that. last but not least knitting is a proven therapy for treating anorexia and bulimia why I would I because it gives people uh, something else to focus on other than that wow. addiction, which it basically is. I would know because I've been there. Wow, it was actually in a yeah. treatment facility for an eating disorder that knitting first saved my life. That's incredible. Thank you for sharing that. That's a really big deal. And you Thank know, I you. also see, I see a lot of older people, all, like my grandmother and all her friends, they knit because it keeps them active. It keeps their brain and their body active in their own, you know, with emotion skills. And you actually have what you call a knit formula, which I think is really cool. It teaches people to become the superstars of their own life, like you said. So so what is that formula? K stands for know you can do it. With knitting, we prove that to ourselves every day. Yeah. And no freaking out. <laughs> you're going to make mistakes, especially if you're trying something new, right? Exactly. It just, it, when it happens, just stay calm. Get over yourself so you can work through it. Mm -hmm, I, mm -hmm. be intrepid. You have to have courage in your life. With knitting, you can practice being courageous. All you risk are a few tangles. That's cute. And T, like that. <laughs> transform your mistakes into opportunities. You know, making mistakes can be uncomfortable, but when you make a mistake, that is your chance mm -hmm. to learn and grow. And that is how you can use lessons from, learns from knitting to become a superstar in your life. I love that, <laughs> and I know our viewers are going to want to learn how to knit with you. You also can tell us what, the, what we need to get started, all the different things. So how can they do that? You know, all you need to get started really is the desire and, you know, a ball of, a ball of yarn and some knitting needles. Okay, perfect. And obviously, Knit Freedom Wishlist, right? That's what we have. www.knitfreedom.com. Okay. K-N-I-T-F-R-E-E-D-O-M.com. Amazing. I love <laughs> I'm I'm ready. Thank Yay. you. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so I'm much. Inspired. I'm so excited to help everyone in New Mexico become a knitting superstar. <laughs> thank you so much for being here.